Yo, what is up guys, JRZ Saiyan here and welcome to episode 26 of Dragon Ball Super Reaction. Now remember, I do not understand crap of Japanese, but I'm getting all this from body language, from Herms, uh, from Konzenshu, from Geekdom 101, uh, all my U big, uh, bigger YouTuber friends, the ones that understand more, I'm getting all this information from them and, you know, because they really help out clearing up exactly what's going on and what they're saying especially herms so i, I really enjoyed let me say i really enjoyed the episode guys it was six out of that's i get 6.5 out of 10 or 7 out of 10 it depends on your view a lot of people really don't care for the last two episodes this is next week's the last episode in the uh, resurrection f's arc Re revival f, f arc so a lot of people really don't care but you can't look at it that way, guys. You need to pay attention to it exactly, you know, the way you're supposed to. And uh, maybe you'll get a little bit into it, but most people really aren't getting into the last these last two episodes because they want to get to the new arc already. So I really did enjoy the fight scenes. Um, of course, animation was spotty. I believe animation will be spot on, hopefully, for the new arc. But, um... Yeah, the animation was okay at times, but overall it was good. It was, they had a real, a lot of pretty badass moments where it was pretty badass. I love the fight scenes, they're, they're, they're cool. Doesn't match the actual movie, Re Revival of F or Resurrection of F movie. I, I love the Resurrection of F movie more with the fight scenes and all. Uh, differently wise, especially the one inch punch by Goku. Um, th there's a couple things. Um, I, I like how Goku bit Frieza's tail and all that, and he chops Frieza's neck, which is pretty awesome. He, you know how Whis does to Beerus and Beerus, I mean, uh, Whis did to Vegeta and them. That that's what Goku did to Frieza. I hit him in the back of the neck, and uh, he goes for the for the oh, uh, Frieza goes for the elbow block. He blocks the elbow. Frieza gets some good shots and starts. Key blasting Goku down to the ground. I mean, a lot of the, a lot of the action is pretty badass. So there's a flashback to Namek and Goku showing mercy to Frieza after you know that that's that's pretty much what happens in the in the actual episode. He ends up showing mercy to Frieza again, which is a pretty dumb, but it's all good. So Vegeta wants to step in, but he doesn't um, until the end, of course. And uh, Goku has a lot of confidence in this fight. I mean, a lot of the episode, you assume Goku is getting his ass kicked, which he pretty much is. But he just does. He just he's taking it really, because at, at the end he knows that Frieza is getting tired and his stamina is going down. And actually, he didn't know until Frieza. I mean, until Vegeta kind of he he noticed it in Vegeta that Vegeta knew something and that Beerus and Whis knew something. And so he figured it out after they kind of hinted it. So yeah, that, that was that was pretty cool. Um, Goku and Freezer are fight, fighting each other with key blasts, firing key blasts at each other. Yeah, it, it's it's kind of pathetic compared to the actual movie. Like I said, it, it really doesn't match the movie. But I mean, budget wise, there's a huge amount of budget wise, right? So, like I said, Freezer beating Goku was was pretty bad. You you notice it a lot. Goku's just getting his ass kicked, but he's taking it. He's not fighting back. He is just taking it. Frieza gives Sorbet the word after Goku just turns the fight around. He just stands there. Frieza throws a punch. It hits Goku in the face, and he literally just gets his hand. I mean, he just takes the punch. He hits the crap out of Frieza. Frieza goes flying. He catches Frieza's punch. I mean, he totally turns it around. And um, so what I like the most about this this uh, episode it in the movie I didn't like how Goku got shot while he was Super Saiyan got Super Saiyan even if he was off guard it really doesn't make any sense in the in Dragon Ball Super I love how he went to his normal form and then he gets blasted in the heart from behind that's more believable more uh, that makes more sense because you have to think about it they can lower their power level nearly to zero to where you really have, you're really human in a way, power scale wise. You're pretty much a human and, uh, I mean, you get shot by a laser, you're pretty much screwed. So, yeah, th that makes a lot more sense. And Freeze is about to finish off Goku at the end of the episode and Vegeta interrupts, throws a key blast 
and that's how the episode ends. Ah, my God. Next week is the final episode of the resurrection of F Ark, and I'm freaking hyped, guys. I hope you guys are hyped. I hope you guys enjoy my reaction video. Overall, yes, you should watch the the episode, but only if you're actually gonna pay attention and not kind of like, uh. I just wanted to get on to the new arc. I mean, it's coming, guys. It's coming. Next week's the last episode. And uh, we'll, I'll talk about that in um, a couple of hours, actually. You, you'll get the... Make sure to check out the video on my preview of episode 27. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.